Hey, good morning, good evening, and good afternoon. Welcome back to Psychonauts 2. In the last episode, we managed to get rid of the vines on the machine hoodicky thing. In this one, or now, I'm hoping to find a cure for the bees. Um, what's that down there? What's a psycho isolation chamber? Oh, okay. There you go. That's answering my question. There's one leather. Uh, will you go away? Okay, we've done that one. Get rid of you. That down there. Go away. Perfect. I think I got the order wrong. Why didn't that work? Oh, one, two seagull. Okay, I see. One, two, three seagulls. Perfect. All right. Is there anything in here that can help us? No, okay. <laughs> All right. Chamber, created as therapy, later used to punish kids at summer camps. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Honey. That's a good sign. Let's head up here. Is that honey? Oh, great. Oh, this is what I need. Okay. Let's see if we can... You know... Okay. Oh, I can grab things. <laughs> grab the smoker. Walk up the hill. Perfect. Okay, slowly. Come on, come on. Yeah. Uh, yep. Nice. He's going to live to regret slagging off the bees like that. <laughs> Perfect. Nice. Right, I guess that's it. We made it to the hive then, at least. Wait, there's loads Whoa. of books. That's familiar and scary. You, green needle witch, you don't exist. <laughs> You're just something someone put into my mind, which means. There's probably a very powerful psychic nearby. No. Another hallucination. Great. A very That's not disturbing. <laughs> hallucination. Oh man. Are you going to cast a spell or something? Okay. What? How did you get in here? Oh. Cassie. Security, eh? Cassiopeia. Author of Mind Swarm. Ford Cruller brought me through security. Ford? Ford Cruller? Came back? Yep. Oh, I knew it! I knew he would. But I'm not ready. I've been trying to fix this place up for him, but, but you know these bees are so demanding. Ford wants me to turn on the astrolabe, but it's covered in, well, really angry bees. Know anything about that? Oh, I think I can help you with that. I'm just happy to be useful again. Get out <laughs> of my way. Ford needs me. Oh, I can tend to the queen later. Queen? Okay, okay. I'm sorry. She says I can't talk to you anymore. Wait! Cassie! Who? Who's she? Right, let's go and find out what's going on in here because I just want to crack on oh hello almost walked past you Cassie shh they'll hear you god there's that's a lot of ears would you mind if I snuck a peek inside your mind oh thank you there we go I haven't had a check up since Ford went away because that the last conversation we kind of went round in circles hello hello where the hell are we? Bees? Oh. What the hell? Cassie? I... It's okay. I know why you're here. Right Cassie. Now, to whom shall I dedicate this inscription? 
<laughs> Not that many people find their way in here these days. You must have a good head on your shoulders. Sometimes. Uh, definitely a big one. Oh. <laughs> now, just imagine what you could do if you were using 175% of your brain. Actually, Cassie, That'd be I scary. need to help with something else. We're on a critical mission, but there's a swarm of bees that's making it impossible. Stop right there, young man. Nothing is impossible. If you follow the 25 simple steps I've outlined in my book. <laughs> now then, let's go show these bees what we can do when we put our minds together. There's oh, that pesky wait, what? You. Thank you, young man. I have been looking for this silly book forever. That's wait, okay. She was going to help me. What? Whoever you are. This one? <laughs> wait, librarian. Oh, I'll admit the author was helpful once. Oh. He needed the money to leave the country. But that we were was a talking about ago. the librarian earlier. When the chips were down and we needed to fight to protect our friends. Ah, worthless. Is there another Cassie book in there that could help me? They are all restricted. Hmm. Then again, maybe I could help All of you. them, wait, what? If you were to help me. Okay, there are I'm two listening. Other books missing from my collection. Mm-hmm. Dangerous books. These are the books yeah. that got us into this dangerous situation. These are the wrong books, you understand? All right, Round all right, calm me. down. Take them out of circulation. They are overdue. Understand? Okay. Then you'll Clearly. help me with the bees? I'll help you with the whole alphabet, Sonny. <laughs> <laughs> they meant buzzing bees. Anyway, uh, I guess we go through here. Go, go, go. Perfect. What? Hey, you're not a child. No. On. Oh, it's just you. Well, this shouldn't take too long. What the hell are you? An enabler. So support negative thoughts. Fun. Seriously? Great. All right, so get rid of that. Stop it! No, you're annoying. No. Stop! 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 Ah! Stay down. Ah! Yes, yes, yes. All right. Let's head up there. Oh. Hep. And hep. Perfect. Perfect. Hop, hop. Nice. Come on. Yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hopla. Nice. Don't need that one. Oh, god damn it. Hop. Oh, let's mess that one up again. Come on. Yep. Bada. Nice. Hop. Perfect. Go. It shouldn't have taken four attempts. Uh, can I get through these doors? Oh, no, it's one of those thin doors. I wonder when I'll get that ability. I wonder even if it is an ability. Hmm. Wait a second. I don't remember. Oh, cool. Okay. Let's just venture through the book. Grab the things. Nice, nice, nice. Hup. Cool. Follow the arrow. <laughs> Hupla. Perfect. Oh, was that it? Cassie, you gotta watch out. There's a giant, uh, you out there hunting for you. <laughs> Young Great way of explaining it. Well done. Get it here. That's why she sends in her operatives. Mm -hmm. Who, me? I'm not an operative. I'm just playing along with her until I find the real Cassie. The real Cassie? Tell me, child, what is your name? Rasputin. And tell me, who 
is the real Rasputin? The one you are with your friends? With your family? Or the one you save for your special someone? Hmm? Is that the real you? It's a good point. Or are you actually a combination of all those different identities? Aren't we all? Important challenges in our lives can cause us to create entirely new identities. Well, this is hurting my brain. Ourselves. Sometimes summoning powerful archetypes from our unconscious mind. The hero, the explorer, the shadow. Mm hmm? My special talent allows me to summon up whatever archetype I need to survive my current situation. Right, Would you okay. Like me to teach you how? Yeah, sure, why not? Focus your mind's eye on a vision of the my archetype powers. you need. Let's see. Projection. Okay. I'll plop you here. Most right now. Is it a trickster? Oh! Well, very good. Woohoo! You'll get better with practice. <laughs> he looks a bit disappointed. That's cool, though. Another ability. <laughs> All right, nice. What does it do? Archetype will act on its own sometimes, but you can also focus it on a specific task. Like what? Sup, clone? Ah, uh, that's cute. My clone thinks he's real. I think if I use projection on this door, my archetype would go in there. Oh, it's the thing to open doors and go in small places. Oh, look at there. So cute. Limbo. Limbo. Finally. Spirit. A good nice. For the library. Uh, how do I get through here? Oh wait, where's my clone? Oh, there he is. Uh, point. Oh, that's wrong. How do I? Easy squeezy. All right, stop bragging. Is that a pig there we go. These are on my back. Okay. Cool. Go through here. Come on. squeeze in perfect idiot okay i think this is where i'm going to leave today's episode so if you've made it to the end thank you very much for watching if you're new please do subscribe i make daily content like this every single day of the week and as always i'll see you in the next one